I'm Chrissy, recording artist, performing artist, songwriter, and owner of Chrissy Music based in St. Lucia. As a music creative based in the Eastern Caribbean, especially one who leans more towards R&B, pop, soul, finding opportunities which allow me to grow my career are a challenge. Which is why for me, being aligned with the trade export promotional agency TIPA is such a major benefit. Yes, ever since being aligned with TIPA, I have definitely been able to explore new markets. One such opportunity was my performance at the Burton and Agnes Jazz and Blues Festival in the United Kingdom. Not only was I able to perform before a new audience, I was also able to network, mingle and form connections that I am now using to catapult my career further. My UK performance is just one example of how TIPA and the CARICOM Development Fund, the CDF, an organization who was so instrumental in giving TIPA its start, has been so vital in fostering growth of the music and creative industries within the region. If I had to underscore in one word, maybe two, the importance of entities like TIPA and the CDF, it would be undoubtedly vital. Harris Paints has been in St. Lucia since 1994 and we are proud to say that we've changed the landscape in terms of paint in St. Lucia. We are the only paint manufacturer, and I'm going to repeat that, the only paint manufacturer because we have several paint companies that supply but we are the only ones that produce locally so we are by local company and we are very proud of that. We are really happy that we actually have a partnership with TIPA. Um, TIPA has actually opened the door and not just open it but wide open, has just popped that door wide open for our entrance into the Cuban market, something that we are evenly working with and um, I can um, say because I've been part of that process, it's three years, going on three years now, that without the assistance of TIPA we would have not been where we are today. <laughs> TIPA did quite a bit of research letting us know what the Cuban market entails, what to anticipate, all that work that had to be done, all the research letting us know what the market statistics are and what is expected working in a different environment because remember Cuba is a different government structure altogether. So all that groundwork was laid by research that was done from TIPA through funding from development organizations like CDF. So we are in extension, by extension, grateful for companies, sorry, organizations such as CDF. So when it comes to organizations such as CDF, one word or a few words would be, in my opinion, that they are essential, they are vital, they are invaluable, indispensable. Well, you said one word, okay? But they are really and truly needed for such development to go through. Atelier yeah. Brewing Company is a small brewery, a craft brewery that specializes in making beers um, of great complexity using local agricultural and cultural significant ingredients from the island such as passion fruit, uh, local orange and lemon rinds, um, Bois Bande in a stout, we use golden apple in a beer. Uh, we use a very strong and, and deep understanding of ale making and incorporate what is good from the island and the bounty that's here to make very, very special beers that are getting attention worldwide as a result. The interventions that TIPA makes, not only with respect to getting out and showing our products in different markets, has directly resulted in a large supermarket chain in the United States asking and wanting our beer in the development of a supplier relationship with a buyer in the U.S. Uh, and in opportunities in Mar Martinique, Barbados, Canada and the U.K. Uh, and we continue to work with them uh, in, in obtaining these opportunities and, and filling those orders eventually. 
we're obviously very grateful to CDF uh, and the funding they provide TIPA to uh, facilitate. Uh, without them, obviously, it would be much more difficult for us to gain the information of the markets we're, we're looking to export to. So CDF uh, obviously has the vision uh, and the ability to help um, TIPA and small companies like ourselves reach our goals and, and get uh, beer flowing off the island, people employed on the island, and uh, a healthy respect of what we're doing uh, in this little Caribbean island. I would say forward-looking. It's hyphenated.